Welcome to the Methodology Institute's NVivo video tutorial series sponsored by the LSE Annual Fund. In this tutorial I will show you how to create cases and attributes and work with your casebook. Cases are located in the Cases folder in your nodes. A case in NVivo is a particular type of node that has attributes like gender and age. Most commonly cases represent the participants of your study, for example your interviewees. Since cases are nodes, you can code text extracts under cases. You could code, for instance, entire interviews under a case, like for example Anna's interview in the volunteering project. Attributes are used to characterize the cases of your project. They are located in the classifications folder. Attributes are often demographic characteristics like country of origin and level of education. When your attributes are displayed in the list view, you can create a new attribute by clicking the new button and selecting attribute in this folder. A new attribute dialog box will appear, asking you to enter a name and a description for your new attribute. By clicking on the values tab, you can assign values to the new attribute. To add values, click add and type in the value. When you click OK, the new attribute will be created and displayed in the list view. To create a new case in the navigation view, click the Notes button and select the Cases folder. Click the New button on the main toolbar and select Case in this folder. The New Case dialog box will appear, asking you to give a name and description for this case. By clicking on the Values tab, you can assign values for this case. When you click OK, your new case will be created and displayed in the list view. To define or modify the attributes of an already existing case, highlight the case you want to define in the list view. Then go to the project menu and select Case Properties. The Case Properties dialog box will be displayed. Click on the Attribute Values tab and select the values that you want to have. Then click OK. Your casebook is a table containing all your cases and their attribute values. To open your casebook, go to the Tools menu, select Casebook and open Casebook. Your casebook will then be displayed in the detail view. In your casebook, you can use the drop-down list to change the attribute values in your cases. You can also create new values by typing directly into the cells.